Bookman. We begin with that breaking news in the search for a killer. Police in Brooklyn say three people were shot this afternoon on East 45th Street in East Flatbush. One of the victims has died, and right now a woman is fighting for her life. Eyewitness News reporter Morgan Norwood has the story. And this scene stretching across most of the block is where police say three people were shot, one person killed and another fighting for their life. Right now, police are canvassing this neighborhood, searching for a killer and trying to figure out what led up to all of this. Crime scene tape wrapped the block near East 45th Street and Troy Avenue in Flatbush, Brooklyn. Police racing to the scene around 1.45 this afternoon where they say they found three victims inside an apartment. One 27-year-old woman who had been shot in the stomach, one man shot in the leg, and another who had been shot in the head. Police say he died at the hospital. Police seen going in and out of this apartment building in the corner. The shooting unfolding just steps away from a daycare and Norma's home. I feel fair for it. I don't know what's going on, what, what, what is going on around here now. It's not, don't seem like it's safe anymore. For Vicki Byfield, the sight of blue lights and crime scene tape was just as frustrating as it was frightening. Very upset. I have young kids and I have a grown son and this is very dangerous. Like It's broad daylight and it's not safe. Not safe. There's a daycare over there, church behind us. It has to stop. In Flatbush, Brooklyn, Morgan Norwood, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.